guys, welcome back to my channel and to a home and interiors haul. In today's video, I have so much stuff to show you guys that we've been collecting over the past few months. If you don't know and you're new to this channel, then hello, I'm Emily and we moved into this house in 2020 and we're slowly going room by room renovating it. So at the moment, we're working on a bathroom upstairs and one of our son's bedroom. So there's quite a few things for his room. It's nearly done. So we've got everything ready to go into it. We quickly learned when we started to do the renovations that items differ so much in delivery times. Some things can take eight weeks, some things come next day. So we tried to like order everything as soon as we knew what we wanted. So I'll just show you it all and I'll be sure to put all the links in the description down below so that you can also check them out if you want to. And if you're new, I'd love you to subscribe if you like home content because we have so much coming up. We're doing a big extension out the back of our house in October. But yeah, with all that said, let me start showing you this stuff. And I also wanted to say a huge thank you to today's sponsor, Desenio. They're offering you guys 35% off of prints until the 5th of August. So if you've been thinking about getting some new prints for your home, definitely use my discount code. It's gonna be Emily N. And as I said, that would get you 35% off. So I'll put the link in the description if you wanna check them out. But Desenio have some amazing prints. There's actually so many on their website and they're constantly updating their collections. There really is something Thing for everyone. They also have an amazing gallery wall tool, which makes it really easy to plan out a space. And they ship worldwide, like even if you're in the US, you'll get your prints in about five days. So I have four new ones to show you guys for Caleb's bedroom. This is the first one. This is the balloon moon. And they're, they're quite statement. You can see that they're quite large this time for his bedroom. And we actually used a designer to help with his room. And she was the one who suggested four huge prints. His bedroom is quite long, so she really wanted to make a statement on one side of the bedroom. So we have this one. We also have one that says dream big, another like abstract type one, and then also one that is like the amber sand sign. And since we bought this and sign print, I feel like I'm seeing it everywhere in the background of YouTube videos and shops as well. So I feel like it's very on trend at the moment. I have no idea why though. I actually tried to Google it before I started filming. But I couldn't find anything. So if any of you know why the amber sand sign is currently trending, Ending, please let me know in the comments below. But um, all these prints were obviously from Desenio and the frames were as well. And we also got a shelf like this, which I thought was really reasonable. It was 12 pounds from Desenio. Um, and we're actually gonna put this in the boys' bathroom. And it came in all different colors, but we went for this wood effect. And next up, I wanted to show you this beautiful chair that I'm actually sitting on at the moment. It's got a gray fabric and a black frame and then rattan sides and we found it on Made. This is gonna go into our son's bedroom. The way that we've renovated his room um, means we've taken out a bathroom so he has more space and it's now gonna be a bit of a dressing area. So this is going to sit in that area and hopefully like soften the space and make it look really nice. So it feels lovely. The only downside with Made products is that they take so long to come because they're literally made to order. I think that's why it's called Made. Um, so I think it took like eight weeks or 12 weeks, something crazy like that. And I have had a few comments on Instagram that it's not a very like child's room chair, but he's nearly eight years old and we feel like this is gonna be a bit more of a grown up room for him. He wasn't bothered about having a character room or anything, but he is very into gymnastics. So we've found like some hanging bars that we're actually gonna put in his room. So. He's very excited about that. So I know it's quite a grown up chair, but we really like it and we think it's gonna last a very long time. Then we also got something else from Made. Let me get it. It's this wooden shelf with a black frame and then a circle mirror on top of it. So this is gonna go above his chest of drawers. So we might like put his little hairbrush on this shelf here and he can do his hair and have a look in the mirror. And next up, I wanted to show you the most beautiful statement light for Caleb's bedroom. I love it so much. We found it on a website called Ocean Lighting and it's like a natural wood 
pendant light. So we just put the bulb in there. It's very simple and they had quite a few different styles on their website, but I just love it. I think it's going to be really effective and it's going to go above his bed. And then in his dressing area, we're going to have this light. So we're going to have two separate ones because we kind of wanted to make the spaces feel separate. Um, so this was from Le Redoute. They do it in black or they did a really nice gold one as well. And we're going to be able to direct it to his wardrobes. Um, so yeah, I'm really pleased with the lighting for his room. I also recently got this little ornament and it has a bit of a sentimental story to it. When I was growing up, my grandma had cast iron ornaments like this in her house. She had a little dancer and a little family as well and I remember loving them so much. So I wanted to find one for our home. So I started researching and I found quite a few on Amazon and other stores as well. But often in them, there would be a family of five. I could find that no problem, but there would normally be one with like long hair, like almost like it was a girl. So I just couldn't find one that was three boys. But on John Lewis, I found this one, which is like kind of gender neutral because nobody has hair. So there's daddy, there's a mummy, and then there's three little ones. Um, and I just love it. I don't think it's actually cast iron because it's like not heavy enough, um, but they're all stood together like holding hands and they're actually on a little heart as well, which is really sweet. So yeah, I love it. And I think it's gonna sit in this um, front room. I also got a few new bits for our kitchen in the Emma Bridgewater sale. You may have noticed that I quite like her products. I often show her mugs in my vlogs, but they can be quite pricey. So I do normally wait for the sales and I got some new enamel cookware. So first off, I got a little gravy or sauce holder because we actually only have one that is like a Christmas sleigh. So when it's not Christmas, it's a bit odd when I get that out. I also got this fish pie tin and it says fish pie on one side, but then it also says roast lamb on the other. And then I also got one that says crumble on one side and pudding on the other. Next up, let's talk about throws and cushions because I have quite a few new ones to show you guys and I know it's summer and it might feel weird to talk about throws, but I love the way they just look in a space like thrown on a chair or thrown on the end of a bed. Um, so we've got two new ones and often I'll just get throws from Primark or HomeSense, but these are actually quite good quality ones. So this one is for Kayla's bedroom. In his room, we're going for a bit of a Canadian vibe with the wood and and the black accent pieces and then like red tartan check and the pillow as well. So this pillow is from Next um, and it's gonna sit on top of his bed with this one which says into the wild. This was from a website called Cheeky Duda, and I think it was 10 pounds, so it's quite reasonable. Um, so I'll have these two, and then also this mountain pillow. Hold on, whoop. Um, this was from a website called Red Bubble, and it was quite reasonable as well. So I think they'll all look great on his bed with the red throw as well. And then we also got this throw, which I just think is so beautiful. It's very good quality. It's from a website website called Nordic Nest and they do some amazing things but they can be quite pricey but this was 30 pounds off in the sale so decided to get it really like the print it's a plus wool throw it's very thick it's very cozy and I just like the print and it's beautiful so I thought I would show you that <laughs> right so I've just had a little friend come to find me you say hi Jax Hi. <laughs> He's gone already, but I was going to show you guys some planters. We have three planters that are actually going to hang from the ceiling in Kayla's bedroom. And then they're going to have like little artificial plants in them. I actually haven't got the plants yet. If you have any recommendations where to get them, like artificial ones, let me know in the comments. My first thoughts are Ikea, um, but I need to organize it. So this one is like a seagrass planter and I think it was seven pounds from a website called The Gifted Few. So I've got that one. And then these are the two cement planters which are from Le Redoute and they're also gonna hang from the ceiling. So they're all hang together with artificial plants in them and it will hopefully just draw your eye up to the ceiling and like look at the whole space. Um, so yeah, like those. 
Next up, I wanted to show you some new rugs. We've actually bought four rugs since moving into this house because you can just transform a space. And this one was from a website called Benuta. I really like their rugs. We also got the one in Jackson's bedroom from that website. And we've had so many questions about where it's from. Um, but this one is for Caleb's room. This is gonna go in that dressing area, kind of under the chair and like to, again, make it like the dressing zone. Um, and and what's cool about it, it's like a big circle. I will cut away to it so that you can hopefully see what it looks like. Um, but it's also um, not reversible. Yeah, reversible. You can just flip it over and have a completely different print on the other side. So that's quite cool. If we ever wanna like change it up, um, then we can flip it over like that. Um, so yeah, that is the one in Caleb's room. And then we also got one from La Redoute, um, which is gonna kind of go under the foot of his bed. And I really like the print of this. When it arrived and I rolled it out, I was so impressed with the quality as well. Um, it's kind of got this like stripy diamond down the middle and I really like it. And then for Caleb's desk area, we got this new notice board which I really like it was from a website called Rose and Gray and it has a little shelf on the front of it so if you wanted to put any like workbooks or school books you can put them onto that shelf but then you can also clip pictures or like certificates from school onto the actual notice board itself so this is going to go above his desk and the desk in his bedroom and actually the chest of drawers and his bedside table are all from Maison du Monde we've gone for like a natural wood um, and we think it looks great but the only thing is when it arrived I thought the top of it felt um because it's natural wood I was like oh it feels like it's going to be difficult to clean all the time so we've actually had like some little bits of glass made to go on top of the chest of drawers and the bedside table as well because I was thinking if you put a drink down there are going to be like rings on top of it and this is something we did with our dining table and I've talked about before but it's so worth doing I really am pleased that we did it I think for our entire dining table for the piece of glass it was a hundred pounds and for the chest of drawers and the bedside table it was actually 40 pounds I think which seems so reasonable to me and it's just going to protect the furniture so I wanted to show you that um, and then also for his desk area we got a little desk light well I say little it's actually quite big and it bends it's like just a white light that we found on a website called lighting direct and I'm not sure if showing you our electrical socket and our light switches is boring or not but if you are renovating you have to make all these decisions and it actually took us so long to finally decide on these for the upstairs so we decided to go with a matte bronze finish and we're really pleased with them so these are going to be what is um, in the upstairs of our home also in Cave's bedroom we've ordered some wall stickers which are like pine trees so they're just plain black and they're going to go either side of his bed and hopefully they're going to look really nice and just add to that like Canadian vibe that I was telling you about and the last thing that I wanted to show you guys is that we've got a couple of baskets from Laura Dute for shoe storage in our front hall. We had two baskets underneath the sideboard and they were actually just not really working. So I ordered these just for like a few pairs of shoes. Um, and yeah, I read that way they look. Yeah, so that is everything that I wanted to show you guys today. Hopefully you like some of the pieces that we've recently picked up. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And as I said, I will hopefully have a bathroom tour and bedroom tour very soon for you guys. And then our big building project actually starts in October, which I'm excited and scared about because I know how much upheaval it's gonna be, um, but we're excited to really make it our own and I just cannot wait to have a new kitchen. Uh, but yes, anyway, thank you so much for watching. Again, that Desenio link is in the description and my discount code as well. And thanks again, I'll see you soon. Bye guys.